Hello and welcome to One Minute Maya. In this tutorial I'm going to show you how to do a quick sun in the sky within Maya. If I just take a quick render you can see that my uh, scene's got no lighting in it at all. First thing you need to do is go into your render settings, make sure mental ray is enabled and then go on to the indirect lighting tab and then press create physical sun in the sky. If you take another quick render everything is really bleached out it's not looking very good at the moment. Just a quick comparison to what we had before. A few things need to change. If we change the horizon height, as you can see, there is grey showing at the bottom of our sky, which is contributing to light being projected onto our objects. So if we give that a value of negative 2, that should clear that away. There we go. All fixed. At the moment, I think the light source is at a 12 o'clock position, so it's pointing directly on top of the objects, which is the most brightest part of the sun. If we go into our outliner and select the sun, we could actually rotate the sun to determine what time of day it is. So if we put the sun at a low angle, it should give us a sunset. Click for a quick render preview. As you can see, the scene is a lot warmer and the light intensity is not as harsh. It's looking a bit better. Save an image for comparison later. Just going to make a few tweaks. Rotate this in a bit more at a lower angle. Take another render. You can see it's a lot darker and it's starting to feel more like a sunset. A cool thing that you can do with Sun and Sky is if you point the sun towards the camera you can actually see the sun in the sky in the background. So if I move the camera in, point my sun and do a quick render. wait for it to load and there we go you can see the sun you can actually change the size of the sun if you go into your render settings and click on the little arrow next to delete it'll take you into the inputs of the sky shader once in there change the glow sun glow intensity if you do another render you should see it gets a lot bigger there we go this was a very quick and basic overview of the sun sky shader and if you want to get rid of the whole thing, what you need to do is press the delete button and it completely clears everything off. Take a quick render and there we go, back to normal. Thanks for watching.